And everybody, Andy here, AK Montoli. We're back for round two of a vintage league. We're playing Dread. We won the die roll. Gonna have to mulligan this one. That uh, looks decent. Uh, I mean, we don't have a dredger. And. I guess we're gonna get grief. We're gonna keep this. Um, I think I'll put a narc. Oh, maybe I'll get a force. Maybe I just keep it. Put the powder away. Actually, I gotta put a chill away. Is it a dredger? We did not hit a dredger, unfortunately. That's just awful. They're going to force. Okay. What would they be protecting? Probably an ancestral, I guess. I'm not going to do anything about that. That's what that feels like. It could be a needle as well. Swords, bolt, okay. Well, tinker is scary here. Maybe they were just on a tinker plan. All right, I am gonna churn here. I need to find a dredger now. Damn. Well, this has gone about as badly as it could here, but there's not much I can do about it. I'm not gonna therapy. I'm just gonna let the fates be what they are. Like hopefully my opponent just has air. And these decks do have air. I'm going to employ the same plan here. Hopefully there's not a hull breacher. I mean, we didn't uh, hit what we wanted to hit there, but it is what it is. We have not had a lot of success this game with a fighting new treasure, but um, we're somehow still hanging around this game here, so... That's the great news. Ooh, that's a scary one. That's probably going to get us. We have to really hope they don't have anything on top of their library. Hmm. I mean, out of all the spells that they could get off the top of their library, I mean, top's not that bad, but... Uh, being allowed to dig here is very dangerous. But of course, we've been living on borrowed time in this particular game. Gonna do the manifold key trick. Yep. Hopefully that doesn't yield anything for them. Okay, they're tapping their vault, so that can't be good for me. Uh, 
I still think that if I get to untap, I, I mean, I'm really tempted to try and draw a black card off the top of a grief. But I think I just have to spin. A completely suboptimal to do this. I'm losing card value every time that I just discard all my cards. But uh, that's the situation where we're desperate and we're looking for like creeping chills here. Like like we want dredgers into creeping chills to try and just kill them here. If I can find like a oh boy. Well, I might have to empty my hand here. There it is. Perfect timing. I mean, I can get the two card. I can get a card out of their hand for sure. I don't really feel like that's a winning line, though, guys. Like, I'm, I'm guessing in the blind. I'm just going to let nature take its course here. Uh, I have a decent chance of winning next turn if I get an opportunity. Um... Well, sometimes these decks do miss, and they need a specific set of circumstances to get out of this. So they are digging still. Next turn, I can discard the dredger in my upkeep. I can dredge for five. Uh, if I can hit a creeping chill, that will kill my opponent. <laughs> I did put one Creeping Chill on the bottom of my library, and there's one in Exile, which I pitched to Grief. So, like hitting, you know, 2 out of 43, 42 cards is not great. Well, I guess I'm, I'm milling 5. Oof. I hope not. Interesting. Okay, they're just raw drawing it. I guess time vault here. Yeah, they got Tinker Time Vault. Okay. I mean, let's see what they get here, but. We can move along here. We were on borrowed time that game, but I do like our matchup a lot better post board. Mind break traps are good. I also think force a bigger solid. It may be a little harder to make cuts uh, out of the board, but. I'll cut a bridge and probably cut a thug, something like this. Let's try that out. I know, right? Cutting uh, a dredger after what I just went through, probably not the brightest of moves, but that is the world we are living in. Like, I feel pretty good about the match. If as long as we don't mulligan into oblivion, we're we'll be in the game. I am tempted to bring in Wasteland Strip Mine for Urza Saga, Tabernacle, Talarian Academy, but we do have Force of Vigor to manage the majority of those. We do have some counter magic as well, so I feel like we have some game there. And Tabernacle's not the end all be all. Despite I cheated on the amount of Icarids I'm running. Alright, let's see what we can do here. Looks good. So 
So a little bit awkward because I've got the grief and no black card. Like I'm not using the shambling shell for that. I have the luxury here of if there is a ley line that comes into play, I can easily just get rid of these serum powders. Looks like my opponent's holding in five here. Well, hmm. unfortunately, did not work out there. We have an answer to a pithing eagle here, and we have a vigor to be able to pick this up if need be to force a vigor. Something I'm anticipating somewhat of a fast hand out of my opponent here. Tormod script. Yep, you got it. They're just going to go after my drudger, and that's pretty good if they do. Traps are not looking too good at the moment. Okay, here we go. So this worked out great because if they counter, we have my break trap. Just going to get rid of that. I could have let them sacrifice the Lotus to get something out of their hand, I guess. Probably better. My fear was is that they were just going to pass the turn and not do something with the Lotus. Okay. Did not hit a dredger here. I guess the best case scenario here for me would be if they played something like an Urza Saga and we were able to crack both the Saga and the Tormod's Crypt here. Not sure if I'm playing this correctly, being so conservative. Okay, so that's the scenario I was talking about. Let's see if that works. I mean, I didn't feel like they had a force. They, they may have a fluster. Yeah. I am going to bizarre end of turn here. And we bricked. Hopefully we hit one here. Okay, we did. It's not one of our best ones, but it's something we got going here.
Okay. No, they didn't. I thought we were getting to the end stuff there, but evidently we didn't. My opponent has paused here. Okay. So we are going to go. All right, there we go. The Narco Mew is going to be good here, getting a prize amount. And I can also therapy with the. Uh, I got some bridges in the yard. What do we want to name here? I think Tinker. I could take that time walk right out of their hands there. I think I'm gonna. I don't want to give them any time. No pun intended, eh, on the time walk? I'm good, I know. All right, your play. All right, so we know we're in the clear here. They drew a Tundra for turn, so we can just go ham. Uh, we'll go again. Why not? All right. That is lethal. Oh, I guess the Narco Meepo is not. All right. They're going to concede there. All right. I think we played that one pretty well. Um... I feel like the chalice is not really where we want to be. Three, bring it just a random strip line, try something like that. Let's try it out. Sometimes catching your opponent with their pants down, they're not expecting it, can be pretty powerful. Okay. We don't have any protection on turn one, but we had the double mind break trap last game, or I guess we only had one on uh, in our opener, but that's risky playing with the force of vigor like that, isn't it? Okay.
not optimal, but I'm going to try and incite my opponent to uh, crack the, the Academy there, or the Tormod script, excuse me. Having the force feels pretty good here. Time Bolt, how do I feel about that? That's pretty scary. I'm not gonna let that resolve. That's one of the ways I lose this game. I think they're going to crack it here. Yep. Ha! Huh. That would be nice, wouldn't it, Oak? Well, they have one card in hand. We might need some help here. I guess when we dredge on our upkeep, we hopefully can find a blue card for a force of will. And we need that mana crypt to start doing some work. My opponent took the damage there. Sorry, guys, I'm pausing. My opponent is, uh, as you can see, down to 11 minutes here. I'm at 18. They're, uh, they're either double queued or taking their time here. Okay, let's find a blue spell here. All right, so we didn't, but we're just going to try and win the game here. No therapy. All right. Nothing to do here. Come on, Mana Crypt. All right. We lost that one. That's good. So we have lethal next turn for sure. Okay. They got something here. Hopefully it's not a tinker. That would be a bummer. Time walk. Okay. We can deal with that. Come on, Mana Crypt. And one. I don't like seeing that. I mean, I, it's it's only two cards they're drawing, but nonetheless, we are on the precipice of winning here. Okay. They do stall me if they get rid of my graveyard here. All right. 
not going to do anything. Yeah, they maybe drew a rob trap. Regardless, good win, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please hit the like, subscribe button. Feel free to leave any comments, and I will get back to you, and we'll see you for round three.